malnourished dog is recovering this morning after she was found lying near a set of railroad tracks in Claremont. Uh, the pit bull named Hope will need several months of medical care and rehab. In the meantime, Claremont police are asking anyone with information on this dog to give them a call. Ray Brewer joins us live in the studio now with her story. Ray. Sean, it was around 1 o'clock in the morning on a cold, rainy day last week when Hope the pit bull was found abandoned and starving near the set of railroad tracks. Right now, she only weighs 27 pounds, and that's about half of what she should weigh. And she has a long road of recovery ahead of her. Good girl. Hope is weak and needs help walking. This is only the third day since last week that she's drinking water on her own. But despite all of it, she's in a better place now. One thing about her now, she's going to know what love is. The female pit bull is under the care of Kathy Sullivan, the owner of Lost My Way Animal Shelter in Claremont. Hope was found in the middle of the night last week by someone walking their dog on the railroad tracks not far from Sullivan's home. Her condition when she was found, there's no way she walked there. The vet said probably another hour she would have been gone. Sullivan estimates that Hope is between one and four years old. She says the dog has had puppies. Police are aware of the situation, but say it's unclear how the dog ended up on the railroad tracks. Sullivan feels confident that someone left her to die. He has not eaten for quite a while. And this, this, this just doesn't happen overnight. There's no way. I've done this 18 years, and that's the worst I've seen that was still alive. People from Claremont and beyond are now pitching in to help. The Springfield, Vermont Humane Society donating supplies. She's still going to be needing special diets for a long time, and she's going to need um, probably things like massage therapy, and that's not cheap. I mean, if the person is out there that did this, um, please man up. I mean, there is no excuse for this, and they obviously need help themselves. Animal Shelter is accepting donations and has set up a GoFundMe page. If you'd like to help, you can find a link on our website, WMUR.com. In the studio, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.